Hello, my friends, and welcome to the final week for Outbreak Perfected. We're going to be doing Outbreak Refined 3, which is going to involve starting off by going to the Tower Annex and speaking with Ada Ones. We're going to do that to kick this off. Guys, if you do enjoy this one, a like would be super appreciated. It really helps the channel. If you don't like it, let me know what you don't like so I can improve the content in the future. And be sure to subscribe for more content. We do have a lot of Destiny and other gaming stuff here as well. And it's uh, always a good time. That said, I'm going to be showing you guys all of what we have to do chronologically. That means the puzzles, which can can be done uh, the puzzles can be done over in normal mode uh, I'm gonna be showing you chronologically as as they would appear as you go through the mission I'm not gonna be showing you guys the entire mission um, but I'll be showing you guys segments and whatnot if you want to see how to actually complete the entire mission I'll link all the previous stuff down in the description below uh, outbreak refined one and two as well as the very first one. First things we're gonna, we're gonna have to do is go over to the cosmos drone we're gonna be going to devil's layer we gotta get a bunch of kills does not have to be with the outbreak outbreak perfected I just like using it we're going to have these uh, inert SIVA clusters that are going to pop up. They're very, very random. Uh, okay, my son finished his before I finished mine. But once uh, you get them, you got to get 20. It's just very, very random. We can go ahead over to the next uh, part of the mission, uh, which you can see is going to uh, toggle the final pair of switches. Before we do that, once we get to this section here in the mission, the Trevor section, if you will, right, the maze, uh, we're going to go to the left. Uh, so I, like I said, I'm going to be showing you guys everything chronologically, and this is where the first part of the puzzle is going to be. The little console is going to be tucked in this little cubby here. The first one's going to be up here. Uh, it's gonna, not going to be in the exact same order as me, by the way. you got to go back to the console every time to, to double check uh, what these symbols are, and you have to shoot them in the order. Uh, yes, yeah, so I'm going to get annihilated by Trevor, but that's okay. We're just going to respawn. We still have enough time to get this done. If we continue walking down this corridor, uh, down the very first, so again, this is the switches to the left, the very first uh, corridor where the where you'd go to activate the first switch in this maze, you're gonna find the second symbol there, and the third one is right here, kind of where the red pipes are. Once you shot them all in sequence, uh, it's gonna say se sequence accepted, and you know you've done it right, and we can continue on. Uh, all right, so for the switches, once we get to this section here where there's gonna be a, a pipe, we're actually gonna go, go to the right side. There's a pipe over here we're gonna go through. We're gonna go over to the right side. again. This is for the final uh, switches for the catalyst. Uh, if we jump all the way over here, we're going to activate the first switch. And remember, there's going to be two switches. You have a timer. You have a 30-second timer. Uh, there's a little cut there because I did die. Uh, so 30 seconds. We're going to be jumping back uh, you know, from pipe to pipe, kind of going the normal route. The pipe I just landed on would be the one on the leftmost one that you normally come out of. Um, but we're, we're going to keep making our way down here. And what we're going to be doing is going over to these pipes over here. So right here. Uh, and then climb straight up. Once you get to this pipe, just climb straight up. You can see the switch is right there. Uh, so just go over there, activate the second switch. And those are the final switches. So you're going to have the next step pop up for Outbreak Refined 2. And uh, what that's going to involve is completing the exotic mission on Legendary Difficulty. First thing first we've got to do the second part of the puzzle which is going to be uh over here at the end so right after the fire section when you get to the final kind of room right before the boss um if you go look at the kind of tv console here it'll show you what to do doesn't matter <laughs> i'm going to show you what to do activate the sw first switch right here um right to the next uh right beside of the uh the uh, tv console there we're going to go all the way to the right kind of to the uh this one right here uh that's just before where the boss room would be where you'd go for the boss room um if we turn around we're going to go into this room over here, uh, and there's going to be a bunch of switches we're going to have to activate in a certain order. In the back of the room, we're going to activate the one to the right. Then we're going to activate the one to the left uh, in the back of the room over here uh, as well. And uh, if we turn around here, there's a switch right here, which I guess if you're looking into the room from outside to be on the left, uh, but our right. And then we're going to activate the one across from it on the other side of the wall, and that's it. You're done. You're going to have the corruption spreads at number four, and you're going to finally unlock the uh, schematic, uh, not the schematic, but the final schematic for the ship, uh, which if you've done all of the weeks, Outbreak Perfected 1, 2, and 3, all the puzzles, then you're going to go into the uh, your Triumphs Into the Light exotic missions down here and claim your uh, reward, which is going to give you this uh, this ship. It's not... It's not the nicest ship. Okay, there's nicer ships in the game. Uh, I think, maybe you like it. I think there was more potential, especially with the SIVA kind of thing. It ha kind of has a SIVA look to it. The Vimina Junker, I guess is what it's called. I mean, again, it could have looked a little bit nicer. But uh, actually, you know what? This... This might be a throwback to D1. I can't remember. Anyways, uh, once you're done that, uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to finish the ex uh, the exotic mission on Legendary Difficulty. Okay, again, I'm showing you this chronologically. Uh, you might have to restart the mission. Um, and then once you've completed the mission, you can go ahead and pick up the open the chest. And that's going to, you know, open or uh, update your, your quest step. And we're going to be able to go speak to A to 1 to get our final... Um, our final perk, if you will, which is going to be Head Seeker. Uh, also, keep in mind when you're finishing the uh, the boss in in Legendary Difficulty, 
Um, make sure you kill all the ads after. If the timer's still going down, it's because you have to kill the ads as well. Uh, so make sure you do that. But anyways, head seeker, body shots, landed, and all that good stuff. You've seen description on screen. I'm not going to bother reading it all, but you, you know, you, you see what it is. Um, there you go. You have it. You can go to the Enclave. You can put the uh, corruption spreads for on and all that good stuff. You can also grab your... Uh, your um, your triumph as well for completing Outbreak Refined, and that's pretty much it. That's all three weeks. If, if any of this was confusing, if it was too quick for you, let me know in the comments, and ne next time I'll try to make it a little bit slower, and I'll also try to kind of elaborate and explain to you a little bit better in the comments if, if it's been too quick. I'm, I'm trying to make them concise, but also thorough at the same time. So hopefully that'll do you out. If they leave a like, subscribe for more, go check out, check, check out the previous week's ones, and I'll see you guys next week for Final Shape. Till then, game on. See you guys soon. Hey you! What are you doing? Join the Skeleton Army! Do it today! Don't wait till tomorrow because tomorrow will never come. The Earth is gonna fade, that's inevitable. The next second of your life's not even promised, so you better think about where you're going, and you might as well just join the Skeleton Army. Plus, we do kinda like you a little bit, so it'd be nice to see you around here. But if you don't want to, hey, you're lost. See you later!